Alright, this is the one rule <clears throat> when it comes to taxis when coming to TJ Mexico, going to El Centro, or going to go party down there. So when you cross the border, always ask first what's the price. Always ask first what's the price. Because if you don't, some people, not all, but some people that's driving the taxis, you know, they might charge you whatever they want after they drop you off at the destination but most taxis when you want to go downtown or El Centro or um, Revolution Street where most of the clubs are it's like five bucks it's like five dollars five American dollars or sesenta pesos entonces <laughs> just always be aware of that so like I said when you cross the border when you cruza la el puente Always ask them, it's the yellow taxis, always ask them first, what's the price of going to, you know, El Centro, and normally it's five bucks to get dropped off or whatnot, but one experience that I had when I was going to a Rosarito, a Rosarito, con mi amigo, um, and this is like when I first moved out here, um, <laughs> I didn't ask the price, I was just so excited to go to Papas and Beers, I've never been there, it's like another, um, it's another, um, like a club type, you know, um, lounge or whatnot. Um, and pretty much when we got there, <laughs> you know, I was like, ah, cuanto cuesta? But of course in English, because he knew a little bit of English too, he was like, you know, 30 bucks. So it looked the hella boring, you know, there. It's my own personal experience. So I was like, damn, 30 bucks? Just to, you know, from here to there is 30 bucks? And I was like, well, how much is it going to cost to take us back to? Like, oh. We go double that, so that's 60. I'm like, God damn, <laughs> 60 bucks? I mean, damn, I guess. Well, I don't want to argue with them because, like I said, I mean, uh, I'm in a different country and I didn't know the rules out here where it was kind of my fault because I didn't ask the price up front, so it is what it was. So I had to go to the ATM and, like I said, just always be cautious, you know, always have cash on you. Never um, go solo, you know, because, like I said, you know, some people might be in that state of mind where, you know, hey, I need, I need to come up and, you know, él es un gringo. Entonces, uh, es muy fácil para mí. Entonces, no otras personas, you know, saben nada. Um, so, just always be aware that always ask upfront, upfront price. But normally, um, I did go to Rosarito again, uh, Seneca. Uh, the same place, Papas and Beers, you know, with a few friends. And this time, you know, I'm very aware of the, of the prices. So, you know, it's like 20 bucks is maximum, $20 from the border to, you know, Rosarito, uh, Papas and Beers, 20 bucks, that's maximum, maybe 15 bucks, you know, if you kind of um, compensate with them, if they're will willing to negotiate, 15, 20 bucks maximum, but pretty much, it's like I said, hey, you're in a different country, and if you don't ask up front, then pretty much um, the ball's in their hands, and uh, you don't want to argue with that because, you know, it's... Sus trabajos, you know, entonces, that's just what it is out here, though, but yeah, so, normally when you cross over, if you want to, you know, come over here and party, and you want to go to, you know, El Centro, or, you know, Hong Kong, Adelitas, whatever, um, and you want to, you know, go in a taxi, you want the taxi to dr drop you off, it's five bucks, normally it's five bucks, but that's the golden rule that I personally experience is, you know, when you cross that border, um, and, you know, when you get, get inside, you know, the taxi amarillos, it's only five bucks, but just always ask first how much is it, you know, to go to El Centro. But, yeah, so, that's just the number one golden rule. So, just learn off my experience on that. So, yeah, leave comments. Let me know if you have any other questions. Um, and I'll try to, you know, point you in the right direction. But, yeah. Ah, Tijuana Moy, Deliberación. Vamos, pues.